Hello and welcome to my homework and today I will, I will speak about a uh, 4-H uh, each loop. Uh, well the 4-H each loop, uh, before I begin, I want just to type a 4-H uh, so I can uh, give you a sense of, uh, of uh, knowledge of how do you write it. Well, first of all let's, uh, let's type some uh, uh, array uh, int r equals new int whoops new int five variables and let's begin with six uh, nine four uh, minus one two and that's it okay so for each loop how do we, uh, we do that we have for each okay and then we write int number in r okay and then we just type console write line um, zero and then number Okay. Um, let's uh, run this application to see what what uh, what happened. Whoops! Just a second. Okay, six, nine, four, minus one, and two. Um, okay, so what did you what we did we uh, actually did here, um, and why the for each is good, and why uh, and does it have an, any any uh, any shortage any any downsize well yeah um, basically we we need to uh, to use the for each just because it's very easy to write it okay look how uh, how easy to write a for each loop just you need to type like one short one short uh, basically it's uh, two words but one word and then you're done and basically this is the only upside that you have on the for each you have a lots of uh, lots of uh, downsides for it uh, it's much lower than the for loop uh, you can actually uh, change variable during the uh, the array and you can't uh, you can't uh, uh, know which uh, which uh, variable is in the index of the array um, it's harder to to run on the f uh, on on some of the uh, variables and basically that's it, this is it and i will actually uh, start to um, tell you what what did what did you what did we actually uh, did here um, okay so int number number means um, it's the name of the variable that changes of er every interaction okay so this is a number this is a number this is a number each one is a number oh, whoops each n each one is a number and we we actually s say that we we create a number okay in r which is this one this one okay this is our r our array and then we just type it uh, uh, as you know it already i hope um okay so, so this is the uh the for each i hope it will be uh, make some sense and comment and subscribe cheers